What do you want to be when you grow up? A cardiologist, teacher, photographer, or a microbiologist? I have a lot in mind, but I don't know for sure. How do I decide? Confucius says, choose a job that you love and you'll never have to work a day in your life. Pretty amazing, huh? Recently, I explored my personal strengths, interests, and values. I was able to see that I'm a person who is both artistic and enterprising. That means, as an artistic person, I like to make new things. I like to use my imagination when I do anything. I enjoy acting, drawing, and singing. All of these things allow me to use my imagination and be as creative as I want to be. Throughout my elementary career, I have been a leader on a Lego engineering project, held one of the leads in a play about the gold rush, and I'm the captain of safety patrol. All of these activities showcase my leadership skills, which are part of the RIASEC code enterprising. If you don't know what RIASEC is, it is an acronym that represents specific strengths, interests, and values that people might have. R stands for realistic, I stands for investigative, A stands for artistic, S stands for social, E stands for enterprising, and C stands for conventional. My RISAC codes artistic and enterprising help me to know what I might be interested in. Where and what do I do now? How can I take these passions and turn them into a paying career? Yes, a real job to make money. I'm 10 years old and I'm already thinking about a career. What kinds of jobs are out there for someone who likes to lead and has an artistic flair? That was when I came up with the idea that children need to explore different types of careers. But how can we do that? My first idea was to allow kids to have the opportunity to learn about different types of careers. But for something as big as this, I wanted more than just questions. So I began to think. Bits and pieces started to come together. Then, the idea of making a career center program came to mind. The career center building would be a good size so that at least five classes a week could go with their teacher. These classes would focus on students' passions so they can experience jobs that require specific strengths, interests, and values. Imagine if I hadn't been exposed to my passions at age 10. Think about the Hulk never being exposed to his powers. How lame would the Avengers be? Take for example, my sister is 17 years old. She doesn't know what she wants to be in the future. Maybe if she had the opportunity to test out her different strengths, interests, and values, she would know what she wants to be and wouldn't have to be looking at websites for hours. She still looks till this day. It is my dream that all students in the future will continue to have the opportunity to pursue their passions. This will allow them to lead their future, their dreams, their passions, and their lives in a positive, successful direction like I have. Your work will fill a large part of your life. And the only way to be truly satisfied is to do what you believe in is great work. And the only way to do what you believe in is great work is to love what you do, Steve Jobs said. I challenge you to make sure you are passionate about your job and you know your own strengths, interests, and values and follow them.